Hello guys, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to upgrade your system to Windows 10. Uh, basically Microsoft is releasing Windows 10 in waves, um, so you have to wait for your turn in order to install, but you can force it to download and install yourself. Uh, I'm going to show you two ways. The first way didn't work for me, the second way did work for me. So this is the first way to do it. It might not work for you, but then hang on, you can watch the second solution. So you're gonna go to this folder, as you can see here, right here, it's gonna be in the description, so don't worry, just follow, read the description. You're gonna delete everything that's in here. Basically, this is all your Windows updates that you have installed. So you're gonna clear that. After that, you're gonna go to your search window. Let's see, there we go. And you're gonna type in Windows update. There we go, you're gonna start it up. And after that, you're gonna take up the search window again, and you're gonna type in CMD. Basically, you're gonna right click and run as administrator. There we go. So now we have both Windows Update up and the command prompt run as administrator. Uh, so you're gonna paste in this link right here, or this text right here. But you're not going to uh, press enter just yet, you're going to do it like this, you're going to check for updates, and then you're going to type that in. And this is what happens to me, but for some it might take some while, and then you're going to uh, update uh, to Windows 10, etc, etc. But this is what happens to me, so we're going to go to the second way of doing it. So the second way of doing it is basically we're going to trick our system into believing that we are allowed to download it. So we're gonna go to regedit. And we're gonna go to local machine. Um, after that we're gonna go to software. Scroll down to Microsoft. Scroll down to Windows. Window and current version. Windows update, which should also be in the bottom, and here we should have uh, operating system upgrade or OS upgrade. In here, we're gonna create a new 32 bit DigiBird value. Uh, we're gonna name it to allow OS uh, upgrade, and the capital letters are important. Uh, this file might all already exist for you. If it does, don't create one. Just change the value of it. The value should be 1. And now that we've done that, we can just close this down. And if we restart Windows Update, God damn it. There we go. It should now stay upgrade to Windows 10. So that's basically how you trick your system into believing you are allowed to upgrade to Windows 10. So thank you for watching guys.